So you know, funny thing about WWE is uh, all these heels, they they cut these promos on the fans and they blame the fans and everything like that. But uh, ever since AEW started, like these WWE fans are so loyal and they don't hijack shows and they literally do whatever they're told. So Seth comes out and he does a promo, this is backstage, and he's trying to explain that he's upset with Cody because the fans used to sing his song every night. But they but do. But now all he hears is Cody. And I'm but thinking, they bro, they're singing your song every night still. Now you're making up things about the fans. Well, that isn't the... It's not, it was Becky Lynch did the same thing. Yes. You fans turned on me when they were still cheering her. And the funny one also was earlier in the show when the Judgment Day is out there. Uh, Damien Priest speaks first and he says, but he goes, All rise! And you can see in the background, all of these fans stand up. And Damien Priest looks around, and everyone's standing up, and he goes, I said stand up! Like, they weren't actually standing up for the guy. Well, like, it was probably scripted. It was probably scripted, I'm sure though. it was. But yeah. these fans, these WWE fans now, it's like these heels ask them to do something, and, and they do it. Yeah, I've seen that. I've seen that. Um, I forgot the situation, but there was um, a couple weeks ago, there was something exactly like this, and then the heel had to go in there and like complain that they weren't doing it, and it's like, but they, they just, were, but they were. Yeah, I know. this is bizarre. Yeah, well, this they, current WWE fan base is totally bizarre. Well, it's not that it's it's just it's it's just certain fans. Um, but the thing is, no, it's is like that, a lot of fans. It's like all those fans that used to hijack the shows three, four, five years ago. It's like they all just started watching AEW, and now you never see beach balls. You never see the wave. You really, I mean, they'll do the what chant because it's like a Steve Austin thing. But like the yeah, days but, but, of fans hijacking the shows, it's it's like it's over. The fans well, ask yeah, him to yeah. please but, but, rise, but, 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 and they rise. Yeah, well, I mean, you know what? It was it was Roman Reigns, by the way, that where where I remember that where where they did it, where he said to do something, and yeah, he goes script. acknowledge me. And they all acknowledge well, well, him. Well, they always acknowledge him. That's that's something else. But the the um the 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 situation though, it's it's um. But they're, it's not like that they're rabid. I mean, they're actually a um, pretty, you know, lukewarm. I mean, especially tonight, they're pretty lukewarm. It wasn't like, like they've had nights a couple of weeks ago. I remember there was the Raw that was, the crowd was very, very hot. And there was a SmackDown that the crowd was pretty hot and everything. In the Edge segment, you know, I know people, you know, it's all fake piped in. But I mean, I saw that there were points where the crowd was booing them and you can look in the background and they absolutely were booing them you know i mean uh um so but uh yeah it was um you know i it, it's it's a crowd um but yeah i mean but they don't there's also nobody like the thing is is there's the, when the, when they hijack a show it's usually because there's a guy who is not getting pushed who they like and there's a guy who is getting pushed that they don't like. Well, we don't have any of that now. I mean, there's there's no, you know, the super pushes Roman Reigns, but now that he's a heel, everybody likes him. Um, so that's not so no one's going to hijack the show for him. And there's no, there's like no baby face that's like um, that the crowd has just got this organic reaction to, to any great degree. So you know, there's the the. The elements of a hijacking of the show are absolutely not there. I mean, at all. So, yeah, that's, you know, I mean, there's nobody close there. You'd have to have like some guy that they're refusing to push who's who's over. Um, and um, right now there's so there's so few people that they push um, that uh, I mean, there's just nobody who fits that category. Hey, if you're a big fan of Wrestling Observer Radio. We got 12,000 episodes of all of our podcasts up at our website, WrestlingObserver.com. If you sign up today, you get access to every single one of them. The 12 to 18 new shows that we do every single week. You can podcast them, listen to them on the road, at work, working out, in the shower, wherever you listen to your podcasts. And also full access to the Wrestling Observer newsletter and archives. So if you love what you hear, head to WrestlingObserver.com. 12,000 Audio shows at your fingertips.